to say when and we stop. I don't think we'll need to this time. No one touches this tank except for Nicole. You got that? Yes, all right, Elliot. We said okay. You don't have to ram it down our throats, all right? All right, mate. That's it. You're both finished. So strip off your gear, thanks. Your lesson ends here. I think I'm falling in love with you. I really, really like you, Nicole. Don't say things that you don't mean. It's not fair. No, but I'm sorry. I, I do mean it. I no, really mean no, it. you don't. Leave me alone. straight, you actually told Nicole that you have the hot spot. No, I told her that I like her. I mean, honestly, didn't even know I felt that way until seeing right in front of her saying it. No, it just, like, hit me right there and then. And? How did she take it? Not very well. First she didn't believe me, and then she was just more annoyed than anything. Really? That's interesting. What do you mean, interesting? It's a bad thing, isn't it? No, not necessarily. We just have to find out for sure what she's really thinking. Never thought I'd do something like this. What, be honest about your feelings? No, tell another guy's girlfriend that I like her. Relax. You haven't broken any laws. You just gave Nicole a compliment. So what do I do now? When you see her today, you have to play it cool. Got it? Yeah, OK. Then again, playing cool's not really your thing, is it? Basically, you just have to kind of ignore her. And whatever you do, don't be the first one to speak. Wouldn't that make it weird, though? No, that would be cool. Surprise. Why didn't you return any of my phone calls last night? I was totally swamped with homework. I was going to text you on my way to school. Sorry. I guess I'm just paranoid that your dad's opinion of me might be rubbing off on you. I asked him about your brother last night. Really? What did he say? What do you think? Nothing. He went into shutdown mode. Yeah, that figures. He's just trying to cover up what really happened to Mark. Elliot, can I ask you something? Sure. Are you with me because you like me? Or because you just want to get information from my dad? Why would you say that? It's just that you've got this weird thing going on with him and you seem pretty obsessed by the fact that he was there when your brother died. Look, I, I know I've been a bit full on about Mark, but... <laughs> Nicole, <laughs> I'm with you because I like you. I can tell my sister's the one putting in all the work with Roman, and what's she getting out of it? I don't know. Well, not enough. He's too busy running around after your precious Nicole. People think Charlie's tough, but she's actually a real softy. She just wants someone who loves her. Nicole! Hi, hey. I was hoping to catch you before you went to class. Listen, I just wanted to let you know that I didn't mean to say what I said yesterday. I mean, no, I meant what I said. I just didn't mean to say it. It came out completely wrong and at the wrong time. Because, I, yeah, I know you're with Elliot and I should have done that, but I just didn't want you to think that no one else cares about you. Anyway, you know what? Just forget I said anything. And anything at all. I'm, I'm sorry. Jeffrey, what happened to playing cool? You see, Dad obviously hasn't been paying his mortgage, so the banks held off as long as they could and they called to say they have to act on it now. I didn't even think of that kind of stuff. There must be all sorts of bills owing by now. You see, they know the cops are after him, so they've frozen his accounts too. What are they going to do? Well, he's in arrears a few months, so unless I can come up with the money, they're going to value the house and have a mortgagee sale. You're kidding. I can't believe I was in such a good mood yesterday, and now this happens. And the place is a mess, Belle. I, like, I've got a free period this morning, so I've got to go home, clean the place up, get it ready for the valuation, and get all this stuff sorted. Well, I'll help you. No, you really don't have to do that. Well, I want to, and I'm not taking no for an answer. Come on. Come on. What the hell is all it? Colleen, did you... Uh, who ordered all this pasta? Was that Irene? No, it was delivered free of charge. When? Oh, this morning before you arrived. By that woman who was in here yesterday. 
She left you a note. Of course, she wasn't interested in anything that I had to say. She only wanted to deal with you. You know, it's one thing for him to stuff everything up, but when he runs away and makes everything a thousand times worse. You know, sooner or later, it is going to catch up with him. Yeah, but I have to be the one that sticks around and deals with it. Well, is there anyone else in your family who can help? <sighs> Not really. Hey, dude, don't worry about the cupboards. We'll just focus on the main areas, like the kitchen, living, and the bathrooms. I think we're going to go near the bedrooms. Do you think you're ever going to see Dad again? Probably, when he gets desperate enough. You know, I don't even know why I'm helping him out. I mean, all he's ever done is cause problems for me. G'day, mate. Just call around to get the mail. Yeah, just in the counter. So, how's business been this morning? Fine. Any takers for the scuba class as the servo? Because if there is, I'll have to refuel the boat. Nope. Not a one. That's what I said. Yeah. Well, I've got to slip around to the diner for a minute and then go to the surf club, so uh, you'll have to take your lunch a bit later today. Oh, I've got a few things I need to take care of. Well, can't they wait for an hour? And I'm planning on meeting Nicole for lunch, so no, not really. <laughs> right, eh, then uh, I'll be back to relieve you shortly. I'll sort the surf club out later. Thanks. Thank you. Not exactly the most fun way to spend the day off, is it? Hey, look, I was thinking, um, what if you could pay off your dad's arrears, you know, get it up to date? Yeah, well, he's not exactly around to make payments anyway, so... Yeah, but if, you know, you could take it over somehow, you could keep the house, right? Maybe, but why would I want to do that now? Because maybe your dad will come back and he can sort it out, or even better still, you could sell the house on the time this right. I'm sure you get a lot more money than the bank will from a mortgagee sale. Well, at least then you'd have something for your future. Yeah, well, I mean, it doesn't matter I don't have that kind of money, so... Yeah, but I do. I've been working for a couple of years now. I have about $4,000 saved. I can't take your money, Belle. It would be a loan. If it means you get something positive out of this situation... It's a lot, right? And I don't expect you to be bailing me out. I trust you. And it would just be to buy you some time and then you can pay me back with interest if you like.